Hi, and welcome to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. And today I'm here with another quick and easy breakfast idea. Today I'll be making loaded tater tot breakfast casserole. And I'll make sure to leave the recipe in the description box. And I will also leave a playlist for a bunch of quick and easy breakfast dishes that I have made in the past. So let me show you what you're, what you're going to need today. You are going to need some cheese and whatever cheese you like is fine. I am using an extra sharp cheddar cheese. You're going to need the seasonings of your choice. I'm just using onion powder and garlic powder. I'm not gonna add any salt because I feel like there's enough salt in everything else that I'm gonna be using today. I am using green bell pepper, onion, and red bell pepper. You can add whatever vegetables you like. You're going to need some breakfast sausage. Howard and I really like a spicy breakfast sausage, so that is what we are using. We're using a hot version. You can use a regular version, turkey version, whatever you'd like. You're gonna need some chopped up bacon, half and half. If you're using milk, that's okay. Some eggs and tater tots. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that I'm doing is cooking up my veggies and my sausage. And while this is cooking up, I've got my oven preheated to 350 degrees. Okay, so my meat mixture is done. I've got it draining on a paper towel to get rid of some of that fat. Now it's time to start putting everything together. So I've got my bowl here, and I am going to add my tater tots to the bowl. And you do wanna keep your tater tots frozen until it's, it's time to use them. So I've got my tater tots, I'm gonna add in my bacon, and I'm going to add in my cheese. And I'm gonna give it a little toss here. I'm gonna add in my meat mixture. And just gonna give it a good stir. Okay, so I've got my tater top mixture to the side, and now I'm going to um, mix up the eggs. So I'm just slowly adding in my half and half and whisking. And I'm gonna add in my onion powder and garlic powder. And again, use whatever seasonings you would like. All right, so I've got a nine by 13 pan here that I have sprayed with some cooking spray. And now I'm just going to add the tater top mixture to the pan. And next, you're going to evenly pour the egg mixture on top of the casserole. And if you'd like to top your casserole with additional cheese, you can, you don't have to. And then I am going to bake this uncovered um, in the oven for about 60 minutes or until that egg mixture is set. Okay, so here is the casserole. I let it cook for one hour on the dot, pulled it out, let it cool for about 10 minutes, cut out a slice so you all could see it. So this is what it looks like. And here it is on my plate. So good and hearty. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.